There's a case in Vigo County where someone refused to quarantine after being tapped or testing positive for COVID-19. I talked with Vigo County Prosecutor Terry Modison, who says his office plans to file charges next week in this case. He says it's not the only violation they've seen involving a health inspector investigation. The prosecutor's office sent out a press release aiming to remind the public that it's a crime if you fail to comply with a health inspector investigation, that it could result in a Class B misdemeanor. Modison says in another case, family members of someone who tested positive gave false information to investigators, which is a Class A misdemeanor. Modisette also says his office has filed charges in three recent incidents for people breaking the stay-at-home order. Each of those cases, however, stemmed from more serious crimes. We're taking it very seriously because his life is different. So we will continue, you know, to respond to the Board of Health when they provide us reports and the law enforcement provides us with reports where people are not following the governor's order. Almodacit says the current overcrowding at the Vico County Jail is taken into consideration when his office files any charges in any case. He says that situation is frustrating for his office and for law enforcement.